Good morning everyone, welcome to the Bright Family Vlogs where every day there is a bright side. Today is September 7th and today is the, like the first day where it's actually cold enough to wear long sleeves. Yesterday was a little bit on the chilly side but I still wore a short sleeve but it was with a thicker shirt so it was okay. Today I'm wearing this Vans shirt. It says Vans at the top left corner and then it says off the wall on my arm. And then I'm wearing this pink bralette from Aeropostale. And then I'm wearing these American Eagle jeans. And because I'm wearing my Vans shirt, I'm wearing my gray Vans. Like every day because I wear my Vans all the time. So nothing really exciting is going on at school today. We had a lot of substitutes yesterday. So it's probably just getting back on schedule with teachers. And yeah. Oh yeah, there is the football game tonight, which I'm so excited about. I talked about that yesterday. I'm really, really excited. I, it is the whiteout game, I think Ethan told me. So we're wearing white. And I'm wearing this white shirt, but I'm also gonna do the like blue and green face stripes or some sort of face design because that's fun. I always like to do that for football games. And then soon coming up here, I think it's in October, every week, every Wednesday of the week, we're supposed to wear pink. And then, um, for breast cancer yeah for breast cancer awareness and there's this like section of students at our school that decorate your face too in pink so that's fun i'm excited i like everything that has to do with school um i start pep club again next week so everything's starting up soon and i have to turn in my student council application soon i should probably do that next week When does it do? The Monday. For student council? Yeah, I should probably grab that before I leave. So I will see you guys when we get home. Good morning. Well, starting this Friday up with the kids missing the bus, which isn't their fault. The bus driver is scheduled to be here at 6.49. And he's been coming at 6.40, which is quite irritating because the kids, they don't want to go stand at the bus stop way longer than what they have to. And I don't blame them, I wouldn't want to neither. So I had to call the bus garage, then they had to tell the bus driver to turn around, and now he wants them there earlier. It would have been nice if they would have told us this beforehand that they want them there earlier. I'm gonna go get Brady up for school now. I'm actually running a little behind getting him up now. I'm ready and stuff, but hopefully he's in a good mood. Let's pray. Brady. Brady. Good morning, Brady. Got school today, and it's Friday. You get out early today. Did you know that? You ready to go to school? You're tired? <laughs> I know. We gotta get up, and we gotta start getting ready, okay? Can you say good morning to everyone? <laughs> All right, bud, let's get moving. Every morning I have to come in Ethan's room after he leaves and shut off his fan because he never remembers. And look at this. This is my struggles. <laughs> Nothing major, I suppose. But why three water bottles? And they all have water in them. Like why? Why do you have to get three? I mean, if you have one up here, then have one. At least drink them. It's so frustrating. Oh, these kids, I'm telling you. He's gotta clean up his room and he's slacking a little bit. He needs to straighten up some stuff. Tonight's the big football game. One of the big football games, it's the whiteout. So all the kids are wearing white. Um, as Gracie mentioned, Brady needs to hurry up, start getting dressed, bud. But um, they always do stuff like that. Do your football games at your schools or your kids' schools do a lot of things like that where they do like white outs, pink outs, Christmas theme, things like that where all the kids kind of dress like that. It's kind of like spirit type stuff. I don't know. Do you guys do a lot of those things? I am going to finish getting Brady ready and out the door because he is slacking today. And then I got some errands to run. What are you eating? Baby. Baby pancakes. 
Do you like those that Mama found for you? Mm -hmm. Brady loves pancakes and orange juice, don't you? It's your favorite. Look at those little bite size just for you. Don't even have to cut them up. Yum. You ready for school today? And today's Friday? And you got up in a good mood today, huh? So what are you doing tomorrow? Going to Pops. Going to Pops while we go to Ed Sheeran? That would be a nice time, huh? Yeah, you should have here about four. Four? I don't know if you would have been able to handle all the people and the big crowds like that. I don't think I can handle all those big crowds. There's gonna be a lot of people. But you'll have lots of fun. Yeah. How far is it? It's about an hour away. For us. It's not that far for you to go to Pops. And then today, you get out early from school. On Fridays, you get out at 2.35 instead of 3.35. So that's pretty cool, huh? Start the weekend off a little early. Yay! Yay, that's every Friday for you. Pretty cool. All right, I won't... I see a pineapple. I won't bother you anymore. You finish those last two pancakes because we gotta go. Okay? Okay. So, Brady's home from school today. Copper, you are a camera hog. You seriously are. Get well, down. We're talking. No. <laughs> so, Brady. You want me to kill you? Copper. You want me to kill you? <laughs> Copper, please. He will not no, let us no, vlog. No. <laughs> we're vlogging. We're talking. We're talking. Okay? So, guys. So. At my school. I had a dance party in the bathroom. And was that good? No. No. It's not funny. <laughs> but it was so much fun. <laughs> and we had to mop the floor. Why did you have to mop the floor? Because the floor was all wet. Because this dude, this kid named Grayson, he didn't lock the door. So we had a dance party in the bathroom. And he put his whole hand on it and then he made my shirt all wet on the faucet yeah and it sprayed at you yeah but now if that happens again what do you do do a teacher you don't that's right and you don't play in, in the water with them right and the teacher was like what did you just say i just said i had a dance party in the bathroom you told your teacher that yeah well, it wasn't your real teacher. It was just the helper teacher, right? Yeah. But you had to clean it up, didn't you? Yeah. Grayson, Brody, and me. Yep. You three had to clean it up. Did you um, have to use the mop? Yeah. So we're never going to do that again, right? Mm -mm. No, because that was bad. And what does Mama tell you when you go to school? Make good choices? Was that a good choice? No, it wasn't, was it? So you're going to be a good boy from now on. Okay. They weren't, teacher wasn't mad, but they said, but she said, you got to be good. What's tomorrow? <gasps> Laundry day. Ed Sheeran. Ed Sheeran, Brady knows. Ed Sheeran. Ed Sheeran. I'm going to Grandpa's house and I'm going to get my Majora's for Halloween. You're going to ask Grandpa to take you to Spirit Halloween? Yeah, I'm going to give him a tour and then I'm going to get that sour can candy that you said no, I can't have. Oh, yeah? Yeah, but I'm going to buy it. You're going to buy it? Yeah, and one no animatronic I'm going to buy. You're going to buy an animatronic? You think Pop's going to buy you an animatronic? Yeah, but all of them are just $100. So how was school, Gracie? It was good. Yeah. Gracie got her school pictures today, which turned out really, really it nice. Really, really, really bad. No, they it turned out. It looks like it ate 20 Big Macs and then took my picture the day after. No, it doesn't. It so you got your school pictures and then you don't even bring them home. I forgot. I was ready to put it on the wall. It looked really good. I did. I gotta look at last year's photo. Last year's photo, you looked like you were five. Hey, this year I look like I'm 37. <laughs> no, you don't look 37. Yes, I do. I'm no. horrible. No, you don't. Show us the picture. I don't have it with me. No, I mean it from your phone that you took. 
Okay, so when she brings them back on Monday, we'll show you because she left them in her locker. Well, I have to think of something to make for dinner. Ethan is at the hey, Ethan's at the football game. It's the whiteout tonight. Gracie was going to go, but her father and I have decided that in seventh grade she doesn't need to go to the football game when we're not there. So the kids that are actually playing in the game are kids that Ethan used to play football with. Ethan used to play football and then he quit eighth grade, I wanna say? Yes, because he did marching band and football for a while. So anyways, so he's at the game with his buddy, I don't Carter. even, Carter? Carter. Mom and I are on our way. We're running a quick errand and I realized that it is like pitch black outside and it's only like 8.30, almost 8.40. And I just like last month it was like 10 o'clock and then it got pitch black, barely. And now it's just dark and summer is just flying by so fast. It's pretty much gone. School starting and everything is ending. All the hot weather is starting to get cooler and all the fun fall things are coming out. I'm very excited. A lot of people think that it's sad that summer is ending, and I like it because I'm sick of summer. There's nothing really to do anymore. We've done everything. We've camped, we've gone to the beach, we've hung out with friends. Fall camping's my favorite though. Yeah, because you can actually enjoy a fire and a s'more. Yeah, like you can sit outside and enjoy it. It's nice. Where a uh, bonfire at 90 degrees in humidity is not fun to me. Mm -hmm. So I think my favorite season is fall. Let me know what your guys' favorite season is in the comments below and I will probably go and reply to some of you guys. On your channel you're gonna do that? Yeah. Now after we run this errand, we are gonna go to Starbucks. Mom said we could go and I think I'm gonna get the dragon fruit drink again. But I'm gonna ask for no ice because they always add too much ice and you get like half. Of no ice or light ice? No ice. But if I even get that, because I might have a new drink that I might want to try. But I'm not going to get anything sugary, because I kind of want to sleep tonight. <laughs> I can see the sky over there all lit up. I'm like, why is it lit up? Because of the football game. Oh. So, yeah, I will show you guys what I get at Starbucks. I'm probably going to look on my phone. So I ordered my Starbucks. I got a mango dragon fruit refresher. And it is my favorite Wait, I drink. I thought it was a lemonade one. No, they have a lemonade one. Oh. But I was in the mood for lemonade. Gotcha. And it's so good. It is my favorite drink ever. I got it with no ice because I wanted more. <laughs> and they always like add, if you ask for ice, they add like literally half the cup is filled with ice and then you get half a drink. And it's pretty much the same as a tall. And you're paying more for less. Mm -hmm. You can go home and add a couple ice cubes after you drink it down if you wanted to. Mm. You know, because then you have like all the drink. Right, because it's kind of weird tasting without the ice. Mm -hmm. And it doesn't give you that sound. It makes me feel weird. <laughs> so, so this is really good. I highly recommend. It tastes like peaches to me. You wanna try it? It's really good. Oh, thank you. She hasn't tried it. She's not living. It's really good. It's not my favorite Starbucks drink. What's your favorite vanilla bean? Yeah. It's because she hasn't tried anything else. <laughs> what is your guys' favorite Starbucks drink? Let me know in the comments below. I will also be replying to those. We are at the store right now. We're gonna get some snacks and watch a movie at home. This new movie that mom said is really good. Well, it's not new. It's a movie from when I was younger, but I think you might like it. It's called Steel Magnolias. It's it's a girly movie. Your dad will probably be like, um, I'm going to bed. <laughs> no, it's fine. He needs to not be cranky for the concert tomorrow. Right. Let's have him go get a good night's sleep so he's not cranky. We should give him some beef jerky. I've got some already at home for him. I think I want ice cream. We have that at home too. Keto? Uh huh. In the kitchen freezer. I don't think I need anything here. Okay. Well, let's get in there and check real quick, and then let's get home and watch a movie. Gracie and I are going to watch a Netflix movie, Steel Magnolias. It's old with Julie Roberts and Dolly Parton. But I remember that when I was a little girl, and I loved it, but I haven't watched it in so long. I watched part of it this morning while I was getting the, ready to get the kids ready for school, and then I couldn't really watch it all. So Jason is downstairs making us some popcorn. Ethan just got home. He was at the football game, and we whomped him, huh? Yeah. 
That team hasn't scored a point in their first three games at all. No, at good. all? Mm -hmm. Not one point? Oh, that's kind of sad. I feel bad for them. <laughs> well, that, that used to happen to me and Steelers for like yeah. three years. Yeah, that's sad though. I mean, at least if they at least scored some. But so it was 49? 49 to zero. At half yeah, time. yeah, at half time. And then we put our second string in for the rest of the game. And then it stayed 49 nothing? Mm -hmm. So the second string, our second string isn't that good? No. Mom, I got on to Well, that's two. sad. Our second string is still better than their first string. I got on to Dad. Because they still couldn't even score. Or do anything. Right. Um. But they only had like 30 kids. Wait from top. Um. So, okay, so tomorrow's Ed Sheeran, and do you remember that my whole theory, I've been saying that I really think Eminem's gonna show up? Eminem's in Detroit right now, because for the football game on Monday, he is doing the coin toss at Ford Field. And Ed Sheeran had let, or Eminem let Ed Sheeran come to his show in London to do the song because they were touring in there together and now they're both in Detroit. So I have a suspicion that he might show up. Jason says no. I think so. Is that Carmel Apple? Yeah. So I think he will. <clears throat> Is that Carmel Apple from Taco Bell? Mm -hmm. Well, that's disgusting. Mm -hmm. What do you think, Ethan? I don't know because it's an Ed Sheeran concert. I feel like it should be the other way around if it's gonna happen. That's what Jason says too. I don't know if I'm saying maybe um, Ed Sheeran it's not, that Eminem should return to you. It's not that yeah, Ed that's it. doesn't swear in his songs at all, but. Right, because Ed Sheeran does swear in some songs. Mm -hmm. So, it's hard saying. Tomorrow we'll know. I have a really, really good feeling though. And you know that usually I'm pretty right with my feelings. I think so. Where's B? You ready for bed? No. No? I'm gonna watch a movie. You're gonna watch a movie too? Okay. Sounds like a plan. Look at Copper over there, trying to sneak some snacks. You know where it's chocolate? Can't have that, Copper. That's not good for doggies. Yeah, yeah. So you had a good time yeah. at the game at the game though with your friends? Was everybody wearing white? <laughs> mm -hmm. Even Ethan. So what's the next game? Is it away? Oh, you have a tiny bit of gray, Ethan. <laughs> Did you get food too? Yeah, I got a burger. At Taco Bell? Oh no, I got a burger at the game and then I got food at Taco Bell. Oh, <laughs> I'm like, they have burgers now? That would be really good. No. That would be good. The taco burger. I've had one of those. It's actually pretty With good. With Monterey Jack cheese. Oh. Well, that sounds like a taco. <laughs> well, a taco burger at Black Rock. <laughs> That's really good. Or PCD burger, sorry. There you go, quesadilla burger. Yeah, because a taco burger has the same stuff. Oh, that doesn't yeah. make any sense. Oh, yeah. A burger and tacos are the same thing. Well, you can have these are hilarious. So our shout out for tonight is going to be Mark Out Loud. Thank you Mark Out Loud for always commenting and watching our videos. We greatly appreciate you and we greatly appreciate all of you. If you would like a shout out on our channel, make sure you leave a comment and that you are liked, subscribed, and have on your notification bell. We will see you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow's vlog is going to be fun. You don't want to miss it. It's going to be the Ed Sheeran concert and we got floor tickets. So we will see you then. Have a great night. Remember, always look on the bright side. We'll see you tomorrow. Good night, guys.